Hi friends, welcome to the unboxing of LG 29 inches ultra wide monitor. The front of the box. Top of the box, the side of the box, back, and the other side. Now let's open this up. Really wide monitor. monitor itself mm. as I don't have anyone help us just excuse me let me take this out and I'll come back to you. power cable power adapter power cable One HDMI cable, instruction manual, and the base instruction manual. Let me set the monitor up. Okay, I assembled the monitor, it's pretty big, I mean, instead of telling big, we can say it's wide. Let's have a look around the monitor, the front, the back. Inputs DBI Display Port Two HDMI Audio In Audio Out and a Power Connector. Uh, this is height adjustable and you can even rotate the height adjustable and you can rotate the monitor also but it cannot be, I mean you cannot uh, ro rotate it in Y axis without turning the, this thing, Z axis it rotates, I am having a hard time getting the entire monitor into a frame, this action is the max it goes in, the max it comes out, at the same time, this can be turned completely 90 degrees. The height can be adjusted up and down. This monitor has only one 
joystick. I hope you have this have a look at it. The control. On the bottom here, this is the joystick which is used to control the entire menu. This is a night, ma metallic black finish, a metal rod, pretty steady. And one thing which you guys need to clearly know is this feels like a thin bezel monitor but I need to turn this on and check whether this is exactly a thin bezel one or not. Nothing in front of this monitor just so this thing. Give me a sec so I can connect the power. Only when you connect through a this is how the monitor looks. This is one thing which you need to keep in your mind. When you actually see the pics of this monitor, the monitor is turned off. But let me turn this monitor off and uh, turn this monitor off you get a feeling that the last pixel is going to be over here I want you guys to really keep in mind let me turn the monitor off on again See, there is a bezel over here which is so the last pixel never starts over here when you turn off the monitor and when you are looking at the pics in internet you feel like the monitor comes the last pixel of this monitor comes over here and it's very thin bezel actually it's very thick bezel which rotates throughout the monitor this is how a full HD video would look like you see the band over here and this are covered and you get the display like this which is like having a 27 inch monitor For a full HD video, you get the bands over here and over here. Most of the websites look like this. It doesn't take the full advantage of the aspect ratio. They come in the center and you will almost have the two sides of it. Just to get a correct idea of how this is, this monitor is, this is exactly
just for the sake knowing whether there would be a costing This is one of the seven speed automatic DSG okay. transmission. Let me 
reduce the volume. This is the one of the main feature which is useful in this monitor. You can connect two inputs at a time. As you can see, I connected my Mac, top, Mac on the left half and my regular PC on the right half. And even the speakers in this monitor are pretty good. Select the audio from which output can be coming. Swap the display. And other options. Uh, Aspect ratio where you can white screen to original. Original aspect ratio. White screen it will scale on its own. Turn the picture on, picture off. 